If I knew, if I knew Living Hill was gonna be like this, I wouldn't have moved here. Cause they act like they run this bill. I'm worried about why my electricity keep going on and off. Welcome to the Investment Properties for Sale show, folks. Thing is selling at or above list. We are going to provide you guys with complete transparency and education. We take you to the video tour. Won't watch TV, giving it to you straight. You know what's sweet about investing in up-and-coming neighborhoods? You know those neighborhoods that are gentrifying, things like property values are going like that? You make a lot of money, right? You get rich. And let's face it, that's probably why you're watching that's probably why you're thinking about buying affordable housing right running affordable housing it's tough right it's tough section a tenants low income things like that it's not an easy business right if you don't believe me please please check out some of this footage from some of our tenants from hell show Yeah, you better tell them son of a bitch to drive in your motherfucking trucks. They better learn how to motherfucking drive. You better understand me, because the fucking next motherfucking time they fucking tired that they fucking don't know how to fucking drive, I'm gonna jump them son of a bitch out of a motherfucking truck and I'm gonna beat the fuck out of them. Do you understand me? You better learn how to fucking drive. If I knew, if I knew living here was gonna be like this, I would have moved here. Cause they act like they run this. I'm worried about why my electricity keep going on and off. See, you looking as ashy as me today. Yeah, I am ashy. <laughs> but I don't give a fuck. Me neither. It's like you ask people to help and nobody, no, I have 11 kids. Yeah. Why aren't they all here? I mean, it was good enough when y'all lay in your head and didn't have nowhere to fucking go. Uh, excuse me, what's no, here? I... When you were laying and not eating food and taking showers, you don't have nowhere to go. Now, where are you guys at now? Everybody wants to sit around and watch mom do it? Bullshit, man. Bullshit. Like, <laughs> I'm so fucking pissed. I know this is. Don't play with me. There's been too many people in this office. That's the that I'm gonna say. Don't tell nobody this thing like they're gonna walk out the door. Talk to me. Tell me who got it so that way I can call that and not get on that nerve. I'm pissed off. That's why I'm pissed. I'm real. Right now, because they have no idea what type of person I am, so I need somebody to do expose Colton and his wife for not letting me know that the place has been sold to someone else who we don't know. And uh, I've been cleaning the basement, but it's like, it looks like Master was all clothes on top of this before, so it's even worse. No, no, go on, go on, go on, please. Because you can't tell me what the say out my mouth. Because you always want to yell Shut and the house, the house got bad the way it was within the last year. I had a, I had a really bad relapse um, with with the mental health, and so I wasn't in charge of anything anymore. The kids were bringing animals home. Um, my son tends to be a little bit of a hoarder, and it, it, it just I just couldn't mentally deal with it. And you know that's my problem. That's not her fault. That's not her on her at all. Uh, but they never really, they didn't give us a chance to get the stuff cleaned out. We were more than willing to clean it out and clean the place. And they said, no, don't worry about it. Stop, 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 stop. <laughs> As you can see, it's a brutal game, man. It's a brutal game. And please, folks, if you're new to the business, I implore you to continue watching the Tennis from Hell show here on Holton Weiss TV because the goal is, the goal of what I'm doing here, what we're doing, what we're bringing to you right now, it's not to just sell everybody uh, rental properties. It's to create a more educated rental property investor. You need to know what you're getting into. If what you just saw makes, makes you scared, makes you want to throw up, makes you want to sit in a corner and cry, maybe uh, low-income housing ain't for you, right? Because it's a tough gig, right? But if it is for you, if you can get into low-income housing, you're going to make a ton of money, right? I have made lots and lots of money with uh, buying low-income, affordable housing, rent to Section 8 tenants, things like that. And uh, the cash flow is really, really good. The Cleveland market is a market where people come uh, from all over the world, right, to get that cash flow, right? Not often is the Cleveland market a market where people think about getting appreciation, buying low, holding for five, seven, ten years, and then selling 
uh, at a much higher price point, right? That's, that's not really what Cleveland is famous for, right? But if you can get in on the ground floor of a market, of a neighborhood that's going up, right, that's gentrifying, you can get that cash flow if you could stomach dealing with the rough stuff. But that's luckily for you what Holton Wise does. We deal with that on your behalf. And then you could sell. And your internal rate of return will be astronomical because you get your cash on cash return. But you also got to focus on your totality, right? The return on your entire investment, including the sale after, right? So that's why if you bet right on the right up and coming neighborhood, oh boy, you're going to get rich, man. And this particular property, I think, is in a neighborhood that's an amazingly safe bet. 3282 West 48th, Cleveland, 44102. Now, it's a duplex. It ain't fancy. It ain't special, okay? It's not really about the four walls, folks. It's where the dirt is, right? See what we have here? I have it priced appropriately for the level of risk uh, that an investor faces right now because what we're dealing with currently is a... Low income Section 8 rental type property, right? You're getting $1,295 in rent at a price point of only $100K, right? You only need to put down $25,000. That's good cash flow today. And guess what? A little cherry on the top for y'all. It's completely lead certified by the city of Cleveland. Now, if you're new to Cleveland investing, this is one of the first uh, episodes of one of my shows you've ever watched, folks. Uh, you need to understand how important these new lead certification laws are in the city of Cleveland. The fact that this particular property is coming to you already lead certified, that's big. That's huge. That's monumental. Okay? You have to do that every two years. Uh, it's just really upkeep after that. Getting it done the first time, though, which has already been done for you here, is big. If you're learning about this market, even if you don't want to buy this property, even if you don't want to do business with me, my team, that's fine. You still need to understand these laws because every single landlord has to adhere to them. I have a video in the notes below this video. It's about a half hour long, right? So make sure you... Get a little popcorn, maybe a little Chardonnay. You pull that lovely lady next to you. You guys snuggle up on the couch. Watch your boy Jay Wise explain to you the lead certification process in a half hour long video. Why? Because it's from the government, folks, and the government don't make nothing easy. And it took me a whole half hour to go through the process. It's not simple by any means. My team, we help make it simple for you. Uh, and you need to understand that. Because right now, we're dealing with uh, a market where these laws are new. And if you look on Zillow, Realtor.com, stuff like that, I'm seeing almost no Cleveland Realtors talking about these certifications. And uh, if your property isn't certified, there's nothing that prevents you from selling it. The city doesn't really come in and regulate it, enforce it, punish you until you try to evict a tenant. They won't let you evict a tenant. Then they're going to probably hammer you, right? So uh, you see people selling properties that don't need lead certification or that are not lead certified, that do need this lead certification work uh, that are technically illegal rentals, and they're just selling them to buyers, and buyers aren't understanding it because these laws are brand spanking new, folks. Uh, it's a pretty big issue. As a matter of fact, I think only like 7,000 of the 80,000 rental properties that need to be certified in the city of Cleveland are certified. So that's a lot of uncertified properties. Do not be the person who catches that hop potato understand what that means and do not buy a property that is not lead certified unless you know it's not lead certified and you're factoring in that lead certification cost into your purchase right like i saw i'm selling this to you for a hundred right now if it wasn't lead certified and it needed let's say ten thousand dollars of lead certified work would it make sense to buy it at 100? No, but maybe if you bought it at 90 or 85, yeah, that makes some sense. But if you don't know that the law is there and the seller didn't tell you or they didn't know or their realtor didn't tell you or their realtor didn't know, well, you're going to be screwed and you're going to be the person holding that, right? So this property notwithstanding, watch that video after this. Back to this property, though. It's already lead certified, so that's great. We got two tenants in there. Lower income tenants, you're going to deal with a little bit of riffraff right now, uh, but you're still going to make a solid return. My team will handle the management. And then looking beyond talking about appreciation, gentrification, folks, if you're going to bet 
in one neighborhood in the city of Cleveland, in the whole Cleveland market, I'm betting right here. It's called the Clark Fulton neighborhood technically, but I call it the Metro Health neighborhood. Why? Because Metro Health is investing a billion dollars into their campus and the surrounding area. If you are sick, if you break your foot, if you're walking and you hit your head on a branch, you know what hospital you're going to if you live in this house? You're going to Metro Health. It's right there. At Holton Wise, we help people achieve financial freedom through passive real estate investments. We provide a complete set of turnkey real estate services, including property acquisition, property management, home renovation, and much more. But most importantly, at Holton Wise, it's all about our people first culture. We put people over profits. Simply put, at Holton Wise, we care. I like working at Holton Wise because it's really for the people and the culture. When I'm here, I feel like I can work as myself. I run Holton Wise like an open book. If anybody has any questions about what we do or how we do it, we got nothing to hide here at Holton Wise. We do what we say we're going to do and then we do it. This place is really for the community. We buy houses, sell houses, we rent houses, we do it all. My leadership style at Holton Wise, it's all about leading by example. I want to show people that even in a stressful business like real estate investment, we always need to keep our cool and act professional. I love working with James and in my position, I get to work with James one-on-one -on -one every single day. James is a people pleaser, he's a people person, he's a real philanthropist. They don't tear you down at Holton Wise. It's all about building people up. What the f are you two lazy pieces of doing in here, huh? Always, always, always just sitting on your f never doing any work. Do you want me to place you girls with f robots? Is that what you want? You want me to f place you with robots, John? Huh? You want me to be replaced with a robot? Even in my position, it can be very stressful dealing with tenants. That's why James always makes sure that my head is in a great place. When making mistakes at Holton Wise, they don't get angry, they don't get mad, they don't yell at you. They just give you a gentle nudge in the right direction. It's the professionalism. You know, nothing too crazy happens at the office. Everything's pretty low key. From the moment I started working with Holton Wise, it was clear to me that I wasn't just another customer. I was like family. I think good leaders ask, how can we increase the bottom line? How can we increase profitability? But here, I want to be a great leader. And what great leaders ask is, how can I serve my employees, my customers, my people, the community? So we're bordering areas that have already gentrified, okay? So we're bordering areas that have already gentrified. We have over a billion dollars being invested in this neighborhood. And I didn't even mention this yet. What about the tax abatements being offered for new construction? In the city of Cleveland, the government, if you build a house that meets new green housing standards, they will give you a 15-year tax abatement. Right, that right there. That could have a value of up to like $150,000, $200,000, right? So... Let's think about this, guys. We're getting a ton of cash flow. It's incredibly cheap. Uh, and as far as wondering if it's actually going to appreciate, it borders the most appreciated, most gentrified neighborhoods in the entire city of Cleveland. And it's getting over a billion dollars of investment. Oh, and guess what? The government's giving tax abatements uh, to developers who are building brand new real estate. Woo! I don't have a crystal ball, y'all. I don't have a crystal ball. Anybody that tells you they guarantee you real estate is going to do this in the future, they're lying to you, right? Nobody can guarantee it uh, for a fact, but we can make educated guesses. But when I make an educated guess, I like to do it by looking at the data, and here the data tells me. Billion dollars, tax abatements, 
bordering areas that have already gentrified. I think it's a hell of a bet, which is why I know this is going to sell quickly. So if you are somebody who wants to buy it, send my team an email, sales at holtonwise.com. You want to pay cash? Cool. Include your proof of funds. You want to finance it? Totally cool. Include your pre-approval letter. You have no pre-approval? Not a problem, dude. Shoot us an email. We'll get you our list of lenders. And if this property's gone... And you don't get the opportunity to buy this, but you want to invest in this particular market. You want to work with my team one-on-one -on -one, uh, below this uh, video. After you're done watching that lead paint video I told you about, uh, go ahead and click the link to book a free call with my team. We'll talk to you how we can get you started on real estate investing in Cleveland, no matter where you live. Because my team, we do it all. After we sell you this particular property, we'll handle the property management, the maintenance, the construction, the insurance the whole shebang getting properties lead certified we do it all for you guys right here at holton wise thanks for watching subscribe to holton wise tv for more financial information education and entertainment